Has this ever happened to you? <laughs> Introducing our new Bang Bang Reactor Controller Starter Kit. Simply apply the components to the wall with the included double-sided sticky tape, wire them up to the reactor, and rest easy knowing your reactor is safe and sound from any unwanted meltdowns. What are you waiting for? Call now and buy today. Hey Fail Rotors, Josh here. It's been a while since we've done Barotram on the channel, but there was one thing in our playthroughs that we glossed over and never really fully explained. Reactor controllers. The reason we needed one in the first place was to prevent one person from our limited crew being handcuffed to the reactor the entire game. It also prevents the reactor from damaging your junction boxes by providing too much power. The particular style of reactor controller we'll be looking at is known as a bang bang controller. It's called this because instead of smoothly moving the slider to the appropriate value, it bangs the slider from fully open to fully closed, and lets the smoothing happen naturally. Why does this work? Magic. In order to set up a simple bang bang reactor controller, you will need the following items. One screwdriver. One grater component. One regex find component. Five wires of any color. In this example, I will be using three blue wires and two brown wires, but you can color code however you please. First, place the components. It doesn't matter where you place them, but keep in mind that the further you place them, the more of a pain they'll be to connect. Next, with an empty hand, left-click the greater component. Set the true value to 100 and the false value to 0. Now, click on the regex find component. Like before, set the true value to 100 and the false value to 0. Now in the expression field, type in the following. Exponent symbol open square bracket, 1-4, close square bracket, question mark, period, question mark, period, question mark, period, dollar sign. What does that mystic set of characters do? Magic. Now comes the complicated part, the wiring. With your screwdriver in your hand, hover your mouse over the greater component and hit E. Equip a wire in your other hand and you'll see it appear on the panel. Drag and drop it onto the signal in one connector. Now hit escape and hover your mouse over the reactor. Hit E, you'll see the other end of the wire. Drag that end of the wire to the load value out connector. The signal in two connector from the greater component goes to the power value out connector from the reactor. The signal out connector from the greater component goes to the set turbine output connector from the reactor. Moving on to the regex find component, connect signal in to the reactor's temperature out connector. Finally, connect signal out to the set fission rate connector. And you're done! I hope you enjoyed this quick tutorial video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, check out our other videos, and maybe hang out during a live stream.